Hi guys and welcome back for another one of my Mental Miss reviews. So today I will be reviewing Suicide Bunny's premium range. Uh, and the e-liquid in question is derailed. I hope you can see that guys. Um, again another quick note on their uh, artwork. It is really cool, kind of like cartoony tattoo sort of stuff. It's really, really cool. They do put a lot of effort into their artwork. Um, so uh, let's get the boring stuff out of the way. Um, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. There's one. Uh, and in the description, I will be leaving links to Suicide Bunny's website, Facebook page and Twitter account. And also the Mental Miss Reviews Facebook page and Twitter account. So uh, make sure you check out that website, uh, follow the uh, Twitter accounts, and like and share the Facebook pages. Um, and let's get on with the review. So on uh, on previous reviews, I have stated that you cannot go on to Suicide Bunny's website and buy direct because they are a wholesaler's, not a retailer. Uh, so if you click onto a juice that you kind of like the look of and you want to find out more about it, um, it does give you the option to go for a, a store locator. Um, now, you type in your postcode, uh, or if you're in America, your zip code, um, and it will give you the closest or uh, a bunch of cl the closest um, shops nearest you that sell their e-liquid. Uh, the first one that I came across was uh, Red Juice, and they're in Cheltenham, Gloucester. Um, so it's not too too close, but close enough for me to check out their website. Um, and on their website, I did I did go over the uh, description of the liquid, and it wasn't very clear, so I I couldn't really jot down too much to paraphrase for you guys. So I went for the flower, uh, flavor notes instead. Uh, and the flavour notes are banana, cinnamon and cookie. So uh, I've done a cinnamon review before and I'll tell you what, it was really nice. So I'm expecting big things from this e-liquid. Uh, so let's get some, some specs on this e-liquid. Uh, the nicotine level uh, options are 0, 3, 6, 12 and 18 milligrams. Um, and the bottle sizes are 15, 30 ml uh, and 120 ml. And the price tags are as follows, 9 95 and 59 So again, as I've said before, it is a bit of a price tag e-liquid, but they are a big company. So you've kind of got to expect the price tag. I mean, there is a lot of effort that goes into um, just the artwork alone. Um, and they come in these nice glass dropper bottles. Uh, so again, that bumps the price up a little bit. Um, the VG to PG ratio is 65 VG, uh, 35 PG, uh, that is the blend. So uh, that's all the stats on the e-liquid. Uh, in my opinion, I'd still say it was a sub omen e-liquid because it's still quite high in the VG area. Um, it's not too thin a liquid, it's still quite gloopy. Um, so if you've got a good sub omen tank, then go for it. Um, or if you're dripping like me, then you know that's good too. I'm dripping this on a dual kenthal coil uh, built at 0.45 ohms, so uh, nothing too fancy. Nice steady build. Um, so I'm going to do my usual two takes now: uh, one through the mouth, one through the nose, uh, and I'm going to see how these flavours really pan out. Um, so she's all juiced up. Let's get get on with it. In the flavour notes it said banana and cinnamon and they couldn't have been more bang on if they tried. First thoughts are it is a smooth vape, it is very very nice on the throat. Real nice uh, even flavours of cinnamon and banana. Uh, nothing too like o over the top. I didn't get too much cookie. So I'm going to do uh, uh, my second take now and see if I can really pick out uh, what the guys on Red Juice have picked out.
I'll be honest, the dominant flavour for me is definitely the cinnamon. The cinnamon really does dominate this juice. It's really nice. I like it. Um, if you're into a, a sickly sweet vape, then this is definitely up your alley. This is going to be an all-day vape. Uh, it is, in my opinion, anyway. Um, Flavours-wise, I kind of got uh, the cinnamon with a, a kind of aftertaste of banana on the exhale. Um, extremely smooth again. And like the aftertaste is kind of uh, kind of cookie dough like rather than cookie I'd say more like cookie dough it's like gives you a nice moist cookie sensation in your mouth it's, it's really nice so that is essentially the end of the review um, I hope you guys enjoyed it so uh, make sure you like share and subscribe to my youtube channel uh, as I said before um, until next time vape on vape happy and always vape safe